um, Thursday. Happy Thursday. Um, hopefully everybody's doing good. Survive that Arctic vortexy thing. Yeah, it was brutal. I will admit it was brutal. Um, we got about an inch of snow. It's gone by yesterday afternoon. Um, trying to it's just, it's brutally, it's been brutally cold. Um, and we're supposed to get like 34 today. I don't know. It's sunshine. That's about it. Um, let's see here. I left you guys, I think I posted Monday. So, yeah, Tuesday I had to go to my naturalist and deal with all that to see. Because um, my, I've been having issues where my guts are not. Where, I, where um, my ass in my guts, my intestines, whatever, is not breaking open the supplements. So, it goes in whole, comes out whole. That's how I'll put that. So, we're going to switch me up to either all tincture liquid form or powder form where I put it in water or juice and drink it. So, I cannot stand the taste of some of it already. And, um, what is it, next week? I think it's next week or two weeks from now. i got to go pick up the the tinctures of a lot of the ones like the ashwagandha, the cat's claw, milk thistle. Yeah, a lot of them up there. <laughs> so, um, right now I'm taking the capsule and I'm breaking it open, putting it in water and, ugh dealing with it like that um tuesday being where it was like minus three degrees all day the wind was 15 plus and it was snowing and i had to go be out tuesday um i didn't post yesterday because it just it had taxed my lungs the cold air had taxed my lungs where it was hurting to breathe so i was having to breathe very shallow and i spent all day yesterday literally curl up on the bed and slept all day it just my lungs hurt my body ached it was tuesday really took it out of me today <laughs> i have slept uh, i've been up off and on since like six this morning but i'm in and out of sleep i i, I don't know tuesday just drained me it really did and it also may be because i'm taking everything that's fixing to come in powder or tincture or liquid form and taking it out of the capsules to doing it like that and maybe i'm just exhausted because i started that today no yesterday and i slept all day yesterday but i know it's i know it's from tuesdays just because my lungs hurt everything hurt not so much as bone which that's a given just my body was just drained and I'm still drained today where I'm going to go and lay back down after I post this because I'm just making a very quick post because I'm realizing um, I'm forgetting what I'm posting or what I'm saying and then I'm all over the I'm all over the place so it's like before I do that I'll, I'll cut it and end the video but um has been started work this week um after not working for five months i think it was four or five months he comes home between six and eight depending on overtime and how long they need to be there he's coming home tired exhausted sore the typical he's just got to get back into the routine um and I'm, for some reason i keep biting the inside of my jaw <laughs> um trying to think <sighs> staying in the house um yesterday i ended up going out long enough to get the mail out of the mailbox went outside checked the mail come back in obviously due to the cold immediately just started having just out of my left note side of my nostril a nosebleed why am i keep biting in my lip i keep biting the inside of my jaw and i'm trying not to <laughs> but um i had to deal with that and that was just 
exhausting to deal with as well. But, um, I'm just drained and tired yesterday and definitely still today. I literally just drained. I will say one thing I did, um, uh, watch last night. Um, anybody who has Netflix, the TV show called Dental Cause. Dental Cause. I think it's called Dental Cause. Um, that's a really good show you guys might want to watch because it's got to do with um, any bad teeth or um, what do you call them? Because they're wanting me to have three of them. Root canals. People who's got metal um, in their mouth and everything and it getting into the jaw and you never feel the pain. You never know about it. You can go into the brain and all that good stuff. Um, cause I'm supposed to get three root canals on three teeth on this side. Um, and now that I saw that part is like, no, I'm not going to do no root canals. I may just have them pull them and then we put the fake porcelains in or, um, what they're suggesting a bridge. It's a porcelain cement bridge to a gap between it to put a tooth. So there's no. Because all that infection can be inside that pocket. And I'm wondering, since I had these, because you can have it done even with your teeth pulled. When I had my, what do you call them? Molar teeth pulled. Usually there's supposed to be a bone that grows back in it. And my top ones in here are fine. But when it comes to the bottom, <laughs> the back one's boned back up. But the one in front of it before it connects to my normal teeth here, um, is caved in. It never had a bone growth back in it. And I'm having a lot of TMJ and false jaw pain. And I'm like, I'm, I'm wondering. And I know i got three teeth that either need to be root canaled or I need to go ahead and get them pulled. And I told my husband, I'm like, you know, it's going to be like from here to here is where these three teeth are. I'm like, I'm probably just going to go ahead and get these things pulled, let them heal, and then get um, the cement bridges, which would be a lot healthier because that could also uh, be a reason why I'm having the false jaw pain because I still have three teeth that need to be root canaled, which I am not going to have now after watching the Netflix show called Dental Cause, Root Cause. It's called Root Cause. Um or dental cause one of the two is what it's called it's a really good show and it it really opened my eyes to going because i was going to go and get root canals uh, this summer and it's like no i'm not now no I, i'll i just rather deal with them being pulled until then i can go and get the bridge put in and nothing drilled nothing sat down in my down in my jaw because i may like last year when they pulled the rest of my back teeth, one of them they had pulled previous year, didn't pull it all out, and there was an infection under it. So I'm wondering, you know, so I mean, I'm still dealing with that. The whole fault's just right here. <clears throat> and it's not a toothache or anything, it's just false jaw pain that you put in a heating pad and ice pack on, and it's just, it's miserable. But I don't know. I'm just pushing through right now. Hopefully, I'll get out of this um, drained, fatigued, ugh, sleep funk, I feel. Because, I mean, even though I'm taking my energy um, supplements, breaking them open, drinking energy supplements, and they're healthy, organic energy. They help with giving you some form of energy, and it's got all kinds of nasty stuff in it. Um I'm not get. I just don't have the, I don't have the pep that I normally do right now. I don't have the, I'm going to push through it and I'm going to get things done whether I feel like crap or not. I just, yesterday and today, I mean, this is as much as I've moved. When I, when I was done and I finally come home Tuesday and it was pouring snow and, oh, so frigid, um, I, I just couldn't sleep Tuesday night. I was just so miserable. And then I slept all day yesterday. But sleeping 
I may have slept, and you guys will know what I'm talking about. You can sleep for eight hours and wake up feeling like you only got five minutes of sleep. And that's how I felt yesterday. And I slept all day yesterday, just long enough to get up, get drinks, take my supplements and all this stuff, my tinctures. And then I was up long enough to say, hi, honey, love you, kiss my butt. And I went back to bed, woke up this morning, and it's like, I'm so weighted down. I'm so tired and fatigued and drained. And I'm really thinking it's Tuesday because it was so cold and I knew my lungs were bothering me from the cold air. So I think I'm just trying to, my body is trying to recoup from Tuesday because that was, that was a day. But um, other than that, when I get off this, I'm probably going to just chit chat with a few people and then. I'm going to go crawl back in bed because I still feel <laughs> no energy and dr like somebody has got a 10 pound weight to each arm and just my head feels like huh, everything just my head feels fine that part it's just I feel so drained and like I'm carrying three of me on top of me drained and just so tired but other than that, guys, hopefully you're all doing good and staying warm from that Arctic vortex. Or I think that's what it's called. <laughs> and I am going to upload this, which takes forever anymore. And I'm going to go crawl back in bed for a little bit longer and see if I wake up feeling a little bit of sunshine on me. Because I hate, I know hate's not a good word, but I do. I hate feeling no pep, no spunk, no spark no gumption and yesterday and today I have no gumption no spark no nothing I don't feel <laughs> I don't feel it today but I love you guys and hopefully you find your silver lining your sprinkle your sparkle and your shimmy and your shake be good God bless and I'm still praying for you all be good guys